The small community of Port Renfrew, B.C., is about two hours northwest of Victoria. And there, they're celebrating the opening of a gas station. They haven't had one in more than 20 years, and this opening will make their lives a lot easier, maybe even boost tourism. Carl Ablack is the vice president of the Port Renfrew Chamber of Commerce and joins us from Coquitlam. Carl, thanks for joining us. Tell me, where was the nearest gas station for you guys? Uh, the nearest gas station previously was uh, about an hour away in a community called Souk, or in the other direction to the uh, east to another community uh, uh, named Lake Cowichan. So it was quite a, quite a drive for anybody to get gas from the community. Now, why did it take so long to actually get a gas station? Well, the original, there was a gas station there about 20 years ago. Uh, and as the uh, commercial logging and fishing community was kind of downsized and the community was shrinking, uh, the gas station wound up and, uh, and we haven't seen service in the community since that point in time. Now, with the resurgence of our community and uh, the ecotourism sense, uh, there's been a demand for this service over the last uh, five or six years since the completion of the Pacific Marine Circle Route. So did people run out of gas all the time in the area? Well, it wasn't necessarily that people ran out of gas. Tourists, it did happen, uh, you know, once in a while. Uh, tourists coming into town didn't fill up in one of the other communities and found themselves without uh, fuel. And then they would search out uh, either at one of the marinas or in some, you know, fuel out of a jerry can out of somebody's backyard to find the, what they needed to get them uh, on their way. You're thinking that this might actually uh, help or boost tourism as well. Absolutely. Uh, tourism Victoria's uh, latest initiative is to uh, promote the Pacific Marine Route uh, on an international stage to bring more tourism to the south of Vancouver Island. And the completion of that route back in 2009 basically put Port Renfrew on the map uh, from a tourism standpoint. And we've seen year over year the amount of traffic increasing into our community, uh, the number of rooms being booked on a nightly basis, uh, just increasing quite dramatically. So the service is going to be uh, well needed or much needed over, uh, you know, presently and in the future. So it really is a cause for celebration. Absolutely. We had uh, a lot of the community out yesterday for the uh, opening of the station, uh, the Pachidoc First Nation. Uh, it's a very proud moment for them because they had the dream of this uh, gas station for uh, many years and uh, bringing this to fruition. It's more jobs for the nation, for the community, and overall, just for the, the overall community. It's just a great thing. Carl Ablack, thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you very much for having me on the program.